This is Jason from iBog.co. Uh, this is going to be a quick little tutorial on how to install the IRTVO program with the Fox 2015 theme activated. First thing you're going to want to do is open your browser. Uh, and then from there, you're going to type in iBog.co and it will come up to the screen. Uh, from here, uh, this is going to be all of the files that I'm going to be hosting that you're going to need for this. Uh, so now we're going to select downloads and give that just a moment uh, here you'll see IRTVO uh, go ahead and select that uh, these are going to be the files that we're going to need in here uh, the first thing that we're going to want to download is going to be the program and info so go ahead and open that up uh, here where it shows IRTVO uh, 1.3.0 RC 11B uh, we're going to click on download. Uh, go ahead and accept the terms and conditions, which is just Creative Commons. Uh, go ahead and select download. Make sure that when you're downloading it, you're saving it somewhere where you will remember where it's at. Uh, I suggest the desktop myself. That's just where I tend to put everything and then drag it to where I need it. Uh, once that's there, uh, go ahead and click downloads again. Navigate through IRTVO. Uh, we're going to want to go ahead and get the two INI kits, which is Cars INI and Tracks INI. Go ahead and download both of those. Once that's complete, we're going to go back to Downloads one more time, click IRTVO again, and then click on Themes. It might help if I actually click on the theme. Uh, you'll see F1, which is one of my extremely mediocre very first ones that I did. Uh, then the Fox 2015 theme. Uh, go ahead and click on download here. Uh, it will come up and you just accept the above terms. It's Creative Commons as well. Click download. Again, put it on your desktop or wherever you're comfortable putting it. Uh, you can go ahead and close the website down from there because you've got all four files that we're going to need. And from here, we're going to want to open up IRTVO first. Um, you'll see release copy, uh, which this is the actual IRTVO information. Uh, there's two ways we can do this. You can either right click and extract all, and it'll ask where you want to extract it to. Uh, this would be my desktop, so I'll go ahead and extract. And then you can have it show the extracted after complete, which is a good idea because we are going to be opening it up. Uh, go ahead and open it up. Uh, this is going to be the folders that we just saw. Now we're going to open cars.ini. And we're just going to drag that over in there. Uh, it will ask if you want to replace it. Uh, click replace. Uh, you can close that one. Do the same thing for tracks. Like so. Replace. It only takes it a moment. Uh, now we're going to open up the themes folder. Uh, right now you see debug and via style. Uh, there's two ways with the RAR. Uh, you will need uh, win WinRAR, which is free for 30 days. Uh, there's and then still even after then it, it allows you to continue using it as long as it's for personal use. Um, so what I'm going to do is just open it and it's going to tell me that it's time to buy online. Close that. Uh, see the Fox 2015? Just drag that on, on over. We'll take it a second. Uh, go ahead and close that. Oh, oh, sorry. Select and copy the Fox 2015 title for the folder. Uh, click back on the release copy. Now what you're going to want to do is find options.ini, uh, which will look something similar to this. Uh, see where it says name equals FIA style? You're just going to want to paste that there. Click save. Close. And now you should be able to open up IRTVO and run it defaultly with the Fox 2015 theme.